<laughs> have you been doing some uh, CS surf lately? Why is your name CS rapper? No, I just be busting fat rhymes, yo. That's pretty insensitive to the rhymes, buddy. But okay. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said fat. I've just been busting sick rhymes. Bro, people really have like COVID though. That's yeah, so people can be like kind of sick. So, uh, busting yeah. dope. Uh, bust. Um, there were people addicted to dope. Yeah, yeah I, you know. I realized before I Drugs. even got it out my mouth. I've I've been rapping. Okay. What have you been like rapping? Mostly about knife crime and cooking right. crack cocaine and Pyrex pots. It's the weirdest genius interview ever. <laughs> <laughs> so what I meant when I said I'm whipping up the powder in the Pyrex pot was I was basically cooking crack in a container made by the company Pyrex. If y'all don't know about Pyrex, that shit is really good. That shit, you drop that shit five times, it don't break. They make high quality glassware, Tupperware, and pots. <laughs> You're sponsored by Pyrex. Yeah, use code FITS for 50% off Pyrex. Speaking of sponsors, this video is sponsored by Skin. That club. When you try to get a skin in CSGO, you have to spend hundreds on cases and keys, and even then it's not guaranteed you'll get what you want. Skin.club is filled with over a hundred custom cases with provably fair odds, ranging all weapons, knives, and gloves. So if you really want a knife but still want to get it in the format of a CSGO case, you can open one of Skin.Club's knife cases, decide for yourself if the odds are worth it, and then be guaranteed to get one. You know the chances right off the bat of you getting the skins in each case, which is what I like about it more than just vanilla case opening. They also provide the opportunity to upgrade the skins you don't like. So if you want box ugly skins on site, you can upgrade them to ones you prefer. Skin.club is regularly updated with new cases, events, and missions that offer free cases. Each free case can be opened daily. And the higher your level, the more cases you can open with better loot. If you're particularly brave or brain dead, you can battle against other players, matching case openings, and whoever opens the better loot takes it all. If you're in need of some skins, head to skin.club and unbox knowing the odds. Click the link in the description and get a 12% deposit bonus. Thanks to Skin.Club for sponsoring this video. Little Dirk at the start of every song has to fucking specify oh. that everything he's saying is cap and not real in case he gets <laughs> arrested by the police. <laughs> everything I'm about to say is not real. This is cap. <laughs> Please do not use this in the court of law against me. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Imagine like opening up a rap song with like a long-winded like lawyer-made <laughs> statement. I'm gonna need you to sign off on the EULA before you hear these bars. Were you guys still in school when Michelle Obama was like, yeah, we're gonna make all the food healthy and then it became pretty much inedible? Yes, dude. I remember when they took the soda machine out. That's when I yeah, knew I Liberal America that. was beginning. Liberal America. First it's the pronouns, then it's the vending machine. <laughs> What's next, our guns? <laughs> it's a slippery slope. First they take away the vending machines. They're gonna put Mexicans in NASCAR. It's gonna be Jose Earnhardt before we know it. <laughs> they make him build his own car. <laughs> he does it easily. Just a poorly built wagon. Have you seen Mexican golf? No. no. It's nice. So after they pipe, they get on a lawnmower and start landscaping. <laughs> I feel like y'all's like J's to foot ratio is a little off. J's to foot? There's a lot of people named J over in Australia, so there actually is a lot of J to foot ratio. <laughs> well, doesn't every J have two feet? So they're kind of also well, that's kind of generalizing. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to offend the one-legged J's in the audience. My apologies. <laughs> I hate how you can't actually do the crip walk if you have one leg. <laughs> I don't think There's you can do any of kind of walking. You should be the most qualified. Yeah, you can't do any kind of walking on <laughs> one leg. Miranda Cosgrove should start a new show called Miranda Writes. Oh. And it's just about <laughs> her as a cop. Miranda Writes, but she's just in NASCAR. What? Oh, because yeah. they go, they, yeah. Because right. they, yeah, they, they, like, they, take yeah. right? Don't they go oh, left? My. Yeah, they don't even go right, bro. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> the show already sucks. You know what's sad? This is, this is real fag. Nobody cared about Harambe until he was until he was dead. It's yep. true. What actually happened with him? Like, did they just they just he fucking tried. blast? I, I know a kid <laughs> fell in there, but they shot him, dude. They fucking shot him. I know they shot him, but like, did they just like did they just blast his fucking skull open like <laughs> uh, with people like in the zoo all I'm around like sure, watching? Sure. I'd like to imagine that they just got a 12 gauge shotgun and just blew his brains out Redness. in front of everyone. The, the kid is just soaking wet in gorilla blood. They got a fucking wooden cross and crucified him. <laughs> 
middle of the fucking zoo. <laughs> oh, baby gorillas for his chest pound. Now you're just pandering to Swagger Souls. Oh, <laughs> I go. gotta win the friendship. Look at him go. Oh, he fell over. That's a big day for the little guy. What a G. That chest pound wasn't even that impressed with them. Dude, what are you talking about? He had so much power yeah, behind it and knocked himself over. Can gorillas feel shame? Sure they can. Like, what would make a gorilla ashamed? Probably if he did something wrong and his mom, like, smacked it. He'd probably be like, oh, it had a little a suck. A subpar chest pound. I'm gonna Google the name. Do gorillas feel shame? Obviously, this is not as developed as humans, and they do not have the self-awareness to self-reflect and truly feel shame or embarrassment, but it is more instinctual. Also, they do sometimes seem to reflect their feelings back to us and can spontaneously feel things without any real awareness of those feelings. Dude, I wish I was a gorilla. I feel like I need a gorilla therapist. That just gives me that raw primal feedback. It's like, yeah, my, my girl and I have been having a really hard time lately. I just don't feel like our communication's falling through. Gorilla therapist is like, yeah, you should rip her face off, dude. You should totally <laughs> rip her I've fucking that face that off. I've noticed that works. Have you tried <laughs> shitting into your palm and flinging it at her? So the shit flinging's not working? Oh, that's weird. That, that always works for me. No, it really works on everyone. You tried <laughs> masturbating with eye contact? <laughs> yeah, I cannot stress how important the eye contact is. Who the fuck is Maurice Li- No wonder I couldn't find you. Your name is Maurice Lozenger. What the hell is a Maurice what? Lozenger? Just the guy that brings you lozenges? You just clap your hands and he places a lozenge on your tongue. Uh, funny name. <laughs> thank you, Maurice. Thank you. He, like, tries to say thank you back, but his tongue has been replaced with a stick of lozenges. <laughs> you got a French kiss your lozenger to get that sweet, <laughs> sweet relief. One giant long strepsil in his throat you have to- French kiss. <laughs> he can't eat pussy, it just makes the pussy numb. <laughs> Maurice just sounds like the sequel to Reese. I need Maurice! <laughs> I need Maurice! It's, <laughs> it's Reese's second channel. <laughs> Maurice! Oh, <laughs> oh, squillium! Oh, I thought you were doing that impression of the girl who was like crushing grapes with her feet and she fell out of the, she fell oh, out of like, the giant yeah. thing. She goes, Love oh, that lady. Oh, Oh, I can breathe. What the fuck are y'all talking about? Yeah. You've never seen that? She falls, she's like, oh, 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 That's like oh, old oh. YouTube. Reminds me of that video of the dog getting hit with a shovel. What? <laughs> what are you watching? You guys haven't seen Shovel Dog? Dog <laughs> with the shovel on him? Shovel dog. dog. Dog getting dog fucking a killed with a shovel. <laughs> it's a real video. Don't look it up. Have you guys ever had one of them, like, full fucking mood changing shits? Oh, yeah. Huh. I've had shits that ruined my day. I have, I've had shits that made my <laughs> Day. <laughs> Same. Soup the other day, weren't you not gonna record until you shit and then you yes. wanted to record? <laughs> <laughs> he was moody until he shit. I was like a, literally like a baby. <laughs> the balls drooped over the cock, hickory dickory cock. The balls the the drooped cock. over the cock? Yes. <laughs> What are you? What are you doing? A handstand? <laughs> you figured out the riddle. I just don't know why they're like throwing food at the paintings when they're protesting oil. Isn't oil in food? Yeah. Well, their father doesn't text them back, so they're mad about a lot of stuff. <laughs> yeah, they need. To, they need to Van Gogh yeah, get some bitches. <laughs> if you press G, you'll win. Oh, it looks so good. Oh. <laughs> if you press me, I might give you information about the American government. Where were you on January 9th? Guantanamo Bay. Oh, all right, you're good. Where were you on September 10th? Plane. <laughs> How long was that plane in the air for just normally flying before it got hijacked? I don't know when hijackings normally happen. Yeah, like, do they do it right off the bat or are the terrorists just kind of like chilling in first class, having some champagne for like a few yeah, hours first? The for a bit. And then they're like, oh, dude, we got to do that thing. And they're like, oh, right. Yeah. You think those terrorists <laughs> on those flights getting like first class tickets? I would have. Yeah, right? It's a lost flight, right? They're dying. Dude, spoilers! <laughs> Flying over, uh, New York this evening. Oh, Jesus. You can see to our left, uh, the Twin Towers. Uh, oh, they're coming in a little close. Uh, they're, uh, um, we're, we're getting a little bit, uh, too, too close. Too close the to the pilot, skyline. Whoa, 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 where the fuck are the pilots? Where are the pilots? We have hijacked your plane. Uh, to the three terrorists that are hijacking our plane? On, okay, we have to keep the masks on the flight. It's a uh, FDA requirement. Oh. Thank you. Oh, sure thing. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. But you are gonna die though. Ah. It's alright. At least it won't be COVID. Yeah, oh, so true. Everyone on board this plane is American scope. Be prepared to die. Ah. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, this guy called me a vegan. <laughs> I don't know which one's worse. <laughs> Time to ramp it up a little bit. 
Oh shit! Damn, you didn't like Bobby. that. You did I it. love me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I said it. Okay, watch this now. Okay. Dude, the lag is impossible, man. That's the lag. Yeah, it's the lag. Yeah, thank you for confirming what I just fucked. <laughs> it's a clear indicator of the lag. He was agreeing with you, but three seconds after it hit his ear. <laughs> man, it's a ping ting. It's a ping ting. They actually do be on seven, and seven to five ping ting. <laughs> it's like when you drop a fork down a flight of stairs. Ping ting ting. That's so specific, bro. How often does that happen to you? <laughs> I think I you got the nuts have for found this. this. Damn, Bobby. Oh my god, his nuts are so big. Oh, oh man, I did not expect him to do that little crab walk. Don't bring up crabs. Did you consider when making your YouTube channel that uh, the do sounds kind of like the poo? <laughs> really funny, man. That's <laughs> that's definitely something I don't hear every day. I don't know if anyone has ever said this to you before. Because <laughs> oh I know you have god. many subscribers and your brand is quite established at this point. It's but serious. your name kind of sounds like poo. <laughs> I've already rebranded since you started this conversation. <laughs> Fuck me. I'm so fucking old. I don't know, for some reason when I'm old, they'll hang out with an Australian accent. Maybe I'll be here for that long. Yeah. You're not gonna get old. <laughs> I'm gonna die young? Is that what you're saying? <laughs> Is that a <Yep>. threat? <laughs> How are you silver two now? I was silver four fucking two games ago. <laughs> You're hanging out with these low rank losers. You literally don't have a rank. Right. Yeah, so you don't know what I am. I could be eagle. <laughs> I could be eagle fly in sky. <laughs> Thanks for the five gifted Jesus. <laughs> Jesus gives you five loaves. <laughs> <laughs> This is so stupid. It was such a shitty fucking day today. It was like fucking awful weather. What do you mean, bro? The weather was shit. It was a great day. Oh, yeah, how? I, it was just nice and sunny. What do you mean? Exactly. Any weather that makes me feel like <laughs> shit for staying inside is bad weather. Why are we staying inside, bro? <laughs> <laughs> oh, they call me the cleanup guy. Cause I'm cl uh, I'm tidying up. My colleagues call me a cleanup guy. Cause I'm, that's some of the janitor. Some of the fucking janitor. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit! What is wrong with this chicken, dude? What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is going on, with chicken? I need to gross, see this chicken. Gross, though, really yeah. picking. <laughs> Oh my god! Bro said oh, oh, oh. He jumped! No, no, he's gonna oh, win now! Holy shit, glitchy chicken.